Hi there, welcome back to Snail Wars, where we wait for, until the galaxy is safe for us again <laughs> to strike out. We're at the moment we're the subject of the Levis Mediators, who are absolutely overwhelming in fleet power. Only the Unbidden are stronger than they are. The Unbidden that don't grow anymore, but they're terrorizing the universe nonetheless. So it's all good. It's all good. <laughs> What will we do to ensure this goal? We're researching like madmen. We're using everything we have available to get fit. <laughs> and I mean, it's working to a part. We're really getting more and more powerful. And we're getting better technology all the time. Or as we call it, Nautilon's gifts. Even been able to capture Altrax, um, not Altrax point, Nautilon's odds from the hands of these unbelievers. In time, this will be a great research world. And we're waiting um, for the great, great project a bit. In only 220, 219 months, <laughs> the Nautiloids will be intelligent or as we call it will be super intelligent will be extremely super intelligent so all is going to be great then by the way levis mediators we want to help right can we help really want to help get more to our <laughs> to our side because we want to survive <laughs> that's the reason the wall, yeah, the wall are harmless right now for us. The other um, guys, though, hmm. the other guys are really crazy. AI attitude. Yeah, there's that. Thankfully, there has been a number of new states founded of the Uzanake, where we have research deals going. They had like every technology there is, so we have a bonus on everything we research. <gasps> One has died, oh no. He was leading the energy sector, right? Oh my, oh my. Hmm. Whom should we use? We need someone very, very good. Maybe we'll use Gerhard Becker. Who else could we use? Carlos Gadores. Should be good in time. He's also an intellectual. We, we, we love intellectuals to do this. So let's add Carlos Gadores here and to Nautilon's odds will be ordered. Hmm. An Archimedes? I don't, I'm not sure. Yeah, he'll be over there. And we're looking for for someone new. Some oh, we have a genius, young genius. We have an intellectual. No, we'll rec recruit the young genius right now. Always need young geniuses. 
we'll put him or her in a ship and we already have that ship so it's no problem Nautilon's egg has pretty good research but I think maybe maybe that system has better one let's see this has about 90 this has 30 fra this has a little less yeah you can learn here on Nautilon's egg that would be awesome oh, wow a 30 year old genius where can you get that Apparently, here, in the Empire of Nautilon's arrival, with the Lefripian League has timed. We traded nothing. They traded monthly energy credits. What? <laughs> what was going on there? They love us because mutual threats. Um, whatever they're cordial so we have friends again that have forgotten everything we have done you will remember when we are in power again you will remember don't know if that will ever be but we'll certainly try Huh. So what should we go for? We should really go for more leaders if we have the possibility to do so after we've modified, of course, our species. Only 207 months. I mean, it's not long. Oh, storage is full. Let's purchase something. Here. There we go. Running along. Oh, that is automatic exploration. We should change that, by the way. Should put her in that ship. And we should put our genius here in that ship. Assisting the research. That's better. That's more effective. Should we go for more extreme choices even? More research? Even more research? I'm not sure. I think that would be maybe too extreme. Then in the case of war, once our fleet is gone, it will be gone forever. So we shouldn't do that. I think it's fine how we do it right now, but Nothing more in that direction will be done. Are the Uzenaka re reuniting? I mean, they're all members of the Condine Pact, so who knows what they do? They are independent still. Let's have a look at them. And they hate us. <laughs> the Siren Confederation. I think they were... No, that's the Bandais. They are also independent. And they hate us. Space Roach is also independent. 
Some of the last ones. Huh, assembly algorithms. Yeah, we can build quicker. The application of game and puzzle theory has the potential to greatly optimize modular assembly and construction. Nice. It's Lego we're going for. Shield hit points are extremely good. I think we must research that. I think we must. That's just too good. Now building cost, is that... Ah, it's not building maintenance, right? That would be powerful then. But it's only building cost. Hmm, Tachyon Lens. Oh, we're going for shield harmonics right now. It's peace. We want our shields to be even better and better. We're the peacekeepers right now. <laughs> yeah, this is like a little sim game. Sim universe. Are they recovering, by the way? Not really, right? They're in a terrible situation. But I think they have just given up some protectorates or something. And these then have joined the Condine Pact. Going on with the Trini here, there's some star fleets flying around. Hmm. No, General G has died. Maybe we can get another one of... Of his brood. Ah, uh, no one really good here. And of the governors. Neither. Hmm. Not even a you can look at that. Not even a young scientist. I think we might will we wait or will we go for another governor? I think we might just go for another governor. But who? That eager one. Young. Doesn't cost anything. There we go. Arush Najak. Ah, uh, that's that's the like the grandson of General G. So um, he calls himself the General G. The younger. And he'll be governor at at a planet, of course. Let's see. Where? Um, not the hap. Oh, I'm in the wrong section here. Now we're right. All these keys, they sometimes make me crazy <laughs> so where would we want someone on oh, Notodon's breath of course there you go General G the younger and where don't we have something here on Notodon's freedom We will change that. We'll put Lebeuf in there. That is not that good. In time we'll gain another researcher. I'm sure of it. <sighs> Once the great project is ready. At least we have some intellectuals as a res reserve. She is very resilient. Oh, he's very resilient, yeah. Getting something out of that. Hmm. 
and now resource storage is full. Let's give them some stuff, some stuff to our overlords. There you go. Like a proper subject would. Can you give us energy credits? Hey, you can. That's too much, eh? That's nice. All right. No, we don't want to bleed you out. There we go. Nice going. And now, time for another battleship? Yes. <laughs> uh, on the other hand, no. We will try upgrade. One eighty months. <laughs> oh man, what a project! Rudolf Brill, yeah, he's wow, he's governing a sector for so long. Cool, cool. Let's have a look at the sectors and stuff. We have an intellectual here, intellectual here, that's important, we don't need an intellectual here. Protectors has been fully upgraded, yes. Very good. They're not much better, but 1000, that's still okay. Mightier by 1000. Ruby system. <laughs> Whatever. <sighs> ah, they have grown back to superior. That's really unfortunate. Yeah, who is most powerful? The ones with the most. Um, Population still. All with the best research. Hey, Jelani Archimedes has leveled up. Nautilon's odds is doing its thing, leveling people up. And making people happy here with a monument to purity. Happy people happy now. Radioactive wasteland, can't we remove that? No. Yeah, well, then we won't. And they still hate their alien overlords. What, what can we do? We can't do anything. Oh, let's build a battleship. We're frustrated. Let's, let's build a battleship, then. That's best. Oh, no. Oh, no. Admiral Jojin Nepti has died at the age of 113. What a giant that was. And we have new extraction patterns. 5% more minerals. Really good for us. Mm, we'll now go for something cheap. Kinetic weapon attack speed. Improvement. Will be great stuff, so we'll go for that. And let's look for another leader. An admiral. I mean, we need an admiral. Georgi Nepti will be remembered well. Who will we hire? An engineer? Let's hire that fire rate guy, maybe. Oh, that, that guy here. No. Let's hire Marshal Ellis. Carl Babcock, though. Marshal Ellis with his fire rate. Yeah, we want him.
It is Marshal Joji, one other of that family. And we'll give him the protectors of the inner shell. True warrior, but yeah. He has suffered. Maybe he'll learn logistics in time. That would be great too. <laughs> When will the Nautiloid species be better? We don't know. <laughs> stars of the stars are so great in their research, it's amazing. Minerals, more minerals. Who wants minerals? Ah, let's build some cruisers maybe. And some others, some destroyers, and some corvettes. And all will be well and nice. System survey complete. Need more power plants. Yes, we need, but how? Why? When? <laughs> Construction complete. Construction complete. I mean, with that very high production and construction should we be able to build a really the spice must flow guys the spice must flow a really dynamic empire oh didn't get anything but at least a long lifespan at least that still very young very resilient <laughs> Yeah, we have no real genius experts at the moment. It's like the slight problem we have. Hmm. Choose system. Oh yeah, there's, there's no pause, that's just the game halting from time to time. It's normal, it's not bound to your computer if that happens to you. Um, it's just what the game does and no one knows why. <laughs> We've had a guy with a pretty, pretty uh, great computer and he also had that problem, he was writing about it. <laughs> 